Oh my God. You guys are having a great day in the life. I am out today with my buddy Keith. We're gonna do a little digging at a Civil War camp that I have been looking at. I think it might have been a Confederate camp, but not exactly sure yet. I did find a Confederate sword hanger here in the past, so let's get after it, see if anything turns up. Look at this. I recognize that as being a kid having one. And look here, there's a signal in the 80s inside of it. You guys know what that is? It's a little change holder. And evidently there's something inside here. What's it say? City? Uh, I don't know. I don't know what that says. Looks like there's a token inside though. One of those good luck tokens. <laughs> well, I could use it today. Is there anything else in here? Nope, it was just that token. But that's a lucky, lucky, lucky token. Well, I just got a signal that I saw before I got. This was in the 40s when I ran my machine over it. And I said, Keith is with me. Hello, Keith. I said, uh, that looks like a button back. And sure enough, it was a button back. And I moved my machine and got a signal and this came out. So we're gonna clean it up a little. That is the face of it. I'm really hoping this is Confederate because I found a Confederate sword hanger in here. So by the magic of video, let's clean this up a little bit. Well, I'm not sure what it is. We tried toothbrushing it, but that didn't work. It's pretty ate up. I'm pretty confident it's a Confederate button just by the size of it, but there it is. There's two pieces and that's a good sign. We are hopefully in the Confederate camp I was looking for. So we're gonna carry on and hopefully find some more. Is that like somebody's murder weapon out here? Like what is, what is the deal with that? I almost don't wanna touch it. That's, uh, that's odd. The blade's bent. Huh. Well, I think I'll leave that one where it's at. Oh my god. I just got a signal here. And it sounded like a shotgun shell. And I popped it out and I thought it was a shotgun shell. But that is a North Carolina button. I wiped it off some. I wish I could show you this field but I'd give away where we're at. Oh man, there's probably more in here. We gotta keep hunting. There's gotta be more buttons in here. This We haven't been in here long at all. Ah, awesome. I don't know what that might be. It's a big old piece of brass. Sure did sound good. Clean it up when we get home. No idea. Oh. I just got another signal about 15 feet up the hill. That looks like it's going to be another Confederate button. Oh my god. That is, it's another North Carolina button. Oh my goodness. I cannot believe this. I've been thinking about this camp for almost a year. Last year I came in here and dug a Confederate sword hanger. And they just cleared it all off. This is going to be a neighborhood in a few weeks. Ah. Oh my goodness. Two North Carolina buttons in one day. And another Confederate button that was on top of the ground. This is one of the best days ever. Keith is in the bottom of the field. He came up and looked at that button and proceeded to take off back down into the field. So we're hoping we'll dig some more Confederate goodies out of here. Ah oh man, what a great day in the life. Looks like a bullet. And that looks like, yeah, that's a Confederate Gardener bullet. Excellent. That makes me happy. Another great day in the life. Digging some relics out here. Hopefully there's some more those North Carolina buttons in here is what we're really after. So let's keep 
keep after it. See what else we can find in this Confederate camp today. What? This happened. Yeah. Oh! Lost your hair. Lost your hat and your hair. That's what uh, a little gnome looks like without his hair, I guess. Is that a troll? What do we got? It's got a signal down in this hole and it just popped out. We believe that it's going to be a penny from a cartridge box. This one's lead. So I uh, feel pretty confident that that's going to be Confederate. So. Another great little find here from in the Confederate camp. Just got a button. Let's go down low, Keith. Careful. It's very brittle. I can't tell, dude. Be careful. It's, uh, it's a two-piece. Yeah, don't mess with the back. It's got the it's shank. It's got the shank still. Where's your toothbrush? Yeah, that's what I need. Very light. Eagle. <laughs> yeah. It's an eagle butt. Yeah. But that's a good find for you, isn't it, Keith? Yeah, man, that's awesome, dude. Excellent. That's beautiful. Good work. All right. Buddy. All right, let's keep at it. There's some Confederate ones in here. We just got a signal here, and I couldn't find it. I looked all around my hole, and it was stuck to my shovel. I found it. It is a button of some variety. Oh, no. It's a shotgun shell. Son of a... I'm not exactly sure what this is big and brass and it has this little uh, piece here and on the opposite side there's this slot right here I don't know what this could be I was thinking maybe a cartridge box insert at first but I have no idea anybody have any guesses on that mystery piece I'll clean it up when we get home Maybe that'll tell us some more. Oh my God, I just got a signal right here. And look at that. I think that is another North Carolina button. Yep, it sure is. Oh man, I can see the N right there. Do you guys see it? We'll clean this button up some more when we get home, but man, how amazing, three North Carolina button. Ah, that is a great day in the life. There's another good signal that just came out. That uh, Confederate North Car that North Carolina button was right down here. There's a nice little buckle. So that's cool. Probably some Confederate soldier lost that in here. Keith had to go home, but uh, we're still poking around in this site, hoping a couple more Confederate buttons might come out. Amazing place. Well, that's going to pretty much wrap it up. It was another great day in the life. Out doing a little digging with Keith. He already headed home, but got a couple Confederate buttons today. Can't really beat that with a stick. Put some pictures of the buttons in here so that you guys can see what they look like once I get home. Man, fantastic sight. Another fantastic day in the life. I hope you guys had a great day in the life. 
See you next time.